I appreciate all the love on the last Walking Dead video. Even though it's been a very long time since the last episode, you know, the last time I played this game. You guys still showed out, showed a lot of love. So thanks so much for that, man. Welcome back to part two, The Walking Dead, 400 Days. So I believe we just finished, we just finished with Russell's story. Yep, <laughs> right on cue. I don't know who the hell's removing all those pictures. Maybe he's looking for all these people. Hold on, let me see if I can scroll down a little bit. Oh no, we can't. Oh, there's some more people down here, but I don't think they're part of the story. So right now we have Vince, Shell, and Bonnie. You know what? Let's hey, let's try out Shell. Let's see. Let's see who that is. Got some coconut water. Gotta stay hydrated. <laughs> Okay, so let's see what Shell is about. So I read some disturbing comments in the last video. You guys told me in Russell's story, the, the body that was rotting. That was the girl uh, Lily shot on the side of the road in, in season one. That's insane. And also the cop from Wyatt's story. That was the same cop that, you know, was taking Lee to jail. And then the car just, you know, capsized. The accident happened. getting pretty good, huh? That's crazy, man. Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? Damn. She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but mm. I still worry. Beck is a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... I don't think that's a good Thanks, way to go, Stephanie. to be honest. You can't really hide stuff from her. You gotta prepare her. Because eventually... Hey. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? We need to get approval as long as it doesn't distract us. Sounds like a that great idea. That sounds like a great Wait, idea. Wait, is this not the same we diner that we're in it, with like uh, some kind of weekly talent show? With that Russell amazing, and that Becca. crazy guy. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't <laughs> want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Hey, let my man tell his story, man. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Okay, sure. Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Uh-uh. I don't want you messing with those unless we're in danger, okay? I'll take care of those later. Uh, I probably should have let her. Shell, yeah, she's not happy. Sec, <laughs> meet me out back. I mean, she's a kid. Them. I don't want her messing with guns, sure but... Thing. I guess she has to get used to it, maybe. Because there's going to come a time where she'll need it. All right, what's this? Eesh, these knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry. They're on our list. Okay, so this is Shell. I'm assuming. And the little kid is Becca. Hey, what up? Okay, let's see. What is this? Blood Did you ever find out what happened there? No. Roman said it was like this when he and Stephanie found the place. Yeah, this... Could be anything these I days, I think this though. is the same diner. Still, better this, not to This has to be... It. It's crazy how they connect everything together. That's wild. It'd be nice to get those windows fixed one day. We will. One day. I can't wait to play season two, man. I, I know it's going to be fire. Story's going to be even more emotional, probably. Can't wait to see Clem again. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. Okay. I mean, if the guns are just laying right there, maybe I should have let her check the guns, because... <laughs> oh, you guys man. need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Okay. What else can we check? Let's check in with Becca. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. Wait. So uh, do they never go outside? Are they always in here? That's crazy. Hold on. Before the, the diner looked her, pretty nice the back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. <laughs> what up, Becca? What? Nothing. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. 
All right, that's everything over there. Where else can we go? Cash register. I mean, what are you doing with cash in this day and age? <laughs> Think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh, yeah. Then we can spend all our money at nowhere. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> that's so funny, man. I mean, is, is it really wrong if you loot and, you know, steal other people's stuff in a time like this? Because you can't use money for anything. You can't get no supply. So if you find some stuff, well, what are you supposed to do, man? God, what I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee in the morning. Hmm. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. Okay. So where's the guy we're supposed to be seeing? We got Glad something we here. we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. Smart. I don't know if it's just me, but she reminds me of uh, of Lily a bit. Lily from uh, from season one. Huh. Maybe I'm tripping. Yeah, she does look a li little bit like her. Ooh, All right, what's this? Starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. Oh, that's actually nice. I don't miss going on raids for this stuff. Wait, is this the same family um Russell was talking about? <gasps> oh, you scared me. He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. Bro, they got a zombie for a pet. What, what the? It's disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. Bro, just you know, put him uh, out his misery or put it out its misery. Mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. He's right. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. Mm -hmm. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta Bro, get back this out is front. insane. They got Let's zombies as soup. pets over here. <laughs> what? Nah, this is the craziest thing I've seen. <laughs> Just put it out its misery, man. Just put one to the dome and, and then it's gone. Okay, why do I have a feeling we're gonna get like bitten or something? Just cause you're feeding it doesn't mean it likes you. Hello? <laughs> Bruh. I don't think he wants to talk to you. All he cares about is his food. Hey, what the dog doing? Oh, God. This is not time to get sad. Wait, what, what's it feeding on? Ugh. Is that a dog? It's literally feeding on a dog. At the, okay. That's none of my business. Enjoy your meal. Let me get out of here. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Don't ever fucking do that again. Whoa. What's your problem? I do this all the time. You that actually scared off. me. I'm sorry. It's it's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I am. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and and now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Huh? <laughs> what the? Becca. <laughs> Shell, Becca. She does not give Something's a damn. Something's going on outside. Oh what no, is here it? we go. I, I knew know, it. It was too peaceful. Bad. We got to find Roman. Okay, let's figure out what is happening. Are they getting raided? Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mop them. Oh, so we found someone. Good. Jesus. Largum. La My God. La Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is oh, he bitten? No. no. They didn't get that close. What did he take? Food, medicine, whatever he could get his hands on. Usual stuff. 
I couldn't get any other information out of him. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck the in. The second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Well, come on, guys. Y'all Yo, gotta be more realistic. Him. They got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. Exactly. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouted. Ooh, that's, that's another right. perspective. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. I mean, nobody travels alone by choice anymore, right? We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I guess that would be okay. We could always use more hands keeping the place Exactly, secure. that's not we a bad idea. More people here. But we don't know if, yep, he's How scouting he for other people, but if he, he's English. with us... This group works because we know how to communicate. Damn. We can find a way for him to help. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. He made us beat up that guy with a mustache and steal his boat. We did that. I've regretted it ever since. And now y'all want to take the high road, Thanks. huh? <laughs> when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. So what's the play? You just pop him? Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so <sighs> let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Oh my goodness. Jesus Christ. Are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. Bro, these guys are ruthless, man. <laughs> what? We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? <sighs> Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. Yeah, they want to pop him real You're quick. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? Uh-oh. This is a tough decision, man. Hey, you know what? Pop him. I don't give a damn no more. Bruh. Fine. <laughs> I guess this is what we have to do. There's gotta be another way. Tell me, what if he comes back with weapons or just, or just a pop game? him? I'm I'm tired. Every time you try to be months? merciful in this game, someone else gets hurt. Pop there him. There really is no other choice, is there? <laughs> oh, what have I can't done? Keep him here. We can't let him go. Let's mop them. If there's even it's a so chance of him coming back, or telling folks that might try to hurt us. Yeah, I, you have to be realistic. You can't trust anyone out here. I won't ask you to watch, but if we do this. We're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger. Hmm. Don't act like you're scared now. You just said to Papa. Bro, say something at least. Any last words, buddy? Damn. 259 days in. So that's like, what, two weeks after? Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? That was a tough decision, man, because he was he was trying to steal some stuff. You know, so who knows, man? Who knows? A decision has been made. Go fish. Bro, they playing I cards out here. I miss playing guitar for everyone. <laughs> I mean, it was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's too yeah, focused she reminds on me making of sure no one's able to break in again. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. This girl's gonna Anyone get us killed, man. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Damn. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. 
We can talk we here, can man. Talk Why here. not? No. Why are they trying to keep a secret Finish from the up girl? Here and come find me. <laughs> Don't take too long. What was that all about? Hmm. Probably nothing. Don't worry about it. He said it was important. Yeah, well, these days everything's important to Roman. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Okay. He didn't sound too happy, so... I guess we're gonna have to find out. Hey, what up? Hey, we got some movement out here. Hey. Oh, no. Don't tell me they found another person and they need my judgment. The executioner's judgment. <laughs> oh, we shouldn't have done it. We really shouldn't have done it. Well, it's way too late now. I don't know, man. I'm just from season one and everything with just having mercy on people and it coming back to bite you in the ass. I don't know. I don't know, man. Oh, Looks he nice, painted that? Boyd. That's dope. Thanks. Yeah, he don't look too happy, though. Hey. Shell, it's Stephanie. What? Roman's got her locked up like some kind of animal. What? They said she was trying to escape. They actually used that word. Escape. Boyd, calm down. I knew something like this was going to happen, Shell. I said if we killed that man, we were heading down a dangerous path. Uh oh and Now look where we are. I'm gonna go talk to Roman. No. No, just take Becca and get out of here. You know I can't do that. Things are good here. We just have to stick together and follow. Bro, the what rules. does he mean by she's trying just to escape? Don't so do are we prisoners stupid. here? Oh man. This is insane. So if I try to escape, what? You're gonna lock me up as well? Okay, Joyce. I'm sure it was her her decision. Hey, I heard about <laughs> Stephanie. Why did she have to do that? We're safe here. There's no reason to want to leave. I'm sure she had her reasons. I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Bro, I mean, if she wants to go, just let her go. It's basically a death sentence. Well. Roman? Good. You're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. Sorry? What are you going to do? You know what we do. What happened? Oh no, what have I done? I caught her trying to escape. I unleashed a killer, man. <laughs> well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Exactly, just well, let her a, go. she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo oh. with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Damn. Yeah. You said that next time it'd have to be one of us. You went along with it last time. You weren't convinced it was the right thing to do. Now I need to know that you're with us. A hundred percent. This is crazy, man. Uh, at least let's, let's talk, talk to, to her. her first. Like, See if we on. can talk some sense into her. No. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. Okay, that is actually she knew crazy. That could mean the death of any one of us. That we is give crazy. Give her a second chance. She might not try to leave so quietly. You got your gun? Damn. In the camper. I mean, the regular laws of judgment don't work out here, man. <laughs> it's not a regular environment uh, to be what do in. I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Damn, that's tough. What are we even going to tell her, man? See, we just have to be honest with her. Can't keep her Shell? in a bubble no more. What's wrong? Am I in trouble? What I'm going to say is going to be hard to hear. What is it? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of ammo and medicine and tried to escape. Oh my god. Yep. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Oh. Why would she do this to us? Oh, this girl's a savage. <laughs> yeah, we got to get out of here, safe man. safe anymore. Ever since we killed that stranger, things have been different. 
Roman's not trying to protect us anymore. He's trying to control us. But it's safe here. I mean, yeah, I want to get away every now and then, but I would never leave. That's crazy. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Uh, let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there. <laughs> in the drawer. Yo, she's so cold-blooded. She does not care. I mean, we made a deal the last time. Made a deal with the devil, I guess. Hey, what is that on the left? Keys? You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? Oh, yeah. We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. The group is going crazy, man. We got to get out of here. No longer than we'd survive <laughs> out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't know, man. I don't care about no rules. This is getting crazy. I don't want this to be who we are. Yep. Just let me do it then. Oh. Huh? Oh, this girl is crazy. <laughs> you know what? I gotta do it, man. Cause I'll we we, it. we made a deal. I you told him the next time. To do something like this. I told him I the next time I'm gonna do it, man. Second. Damn, this, this is really crazy. Sucks. She that is right, though. I mean, where are we going to go? I don't Yo. think we're going to stand a chance out here. <laughs> I mean, they might be crazy, but at least they're principled. Oh, decisions, man. Do we take the gutter? Do we take the keys? At least they're not giving us a timer for this. That would have been dreadful. I don't know. I don't want to pop anyone, but... Damn. What if we're next? What if... I don't know. He thinks we're stealing stuff, or he thinks we're... Hey, we, let's get out of here, man. What are you doing? Let, let's get out of here. Shell. Hell no. Shell, what the hell? Sit down. Get safe. Shell, hey! We out of here, man. Safe. I promise. We what the fuck? Oh. God damn it. <laughs> GG's, man. I'm gone. Oh, I don't know if that was a good decision, but we made it, man. I, I wasn't going to pop nobody. I'm sorry. Hey, you know what? I think, I think I've had enough for today, guys. That was... That was crazy. If y'all want some more, be sure to drop a like on the video. See you on the next one, man. Stay bookmarked.